I had a stroke which affected my brain. I was climbing up on the ladder to get on the roof and clean out the gutters. And I lost my footing uh, at the top of the ladder and just took a header to the concrete. I don't remember anything after I hit. My memory, I had anger issues, impulsive issues, and there was uh, all those types all, of things. Okay. Yeah, all those things dealing with your memory. Okay, so you had a lot of memory difficulties. Yes. Okay. And I'm, I'm torn in two different directions here. I, I would like to remember some of this, but I don't. And maybe it's a good thing, but after I suffered the injury, I changed. I was rude to my wife and I was nasty to people. People that I would never be nasty with. It just changed my mood. My personality changed. Mm -hmm. And I finally got to the point where I just made up what happened to me. I made up a false story and stuck to it. I got the hook and they together joined forces with them and they had my records. I started to get the truth. Okay. And once I got the truth and started working hard and started joining the forces with them to discover what's wrong with me, I started to feel better right away. They're patients. They, 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 give, they give you the feeling they got all day and all week. Just help them. Work as hard as they work and you'll get to the truth. And I did. It's been the best experience I've ever had in a hospital. The people are very sincere to you and they work with you. They made it easier for me to see my problem that I had, because in the beginning I thought I was fine and I wasn't fine. They were teaching me as far as methods, taking like goals of how to work these problems out. Like I had an anger issue. Okay. And yep. with the anger issue, they, they taught me how to breathe. Oh, I see. Okay. On this. That's great. That's and great. Okay. same as far as uh, when my temper got real, real bad. You would breathe and relax your body. Mm -hmm. And we went over pages upon pages of doing like homework mm -hmm. but it's memory skills right. and they also told, taught me memory strategies well they they pretty much guessed what my what I was trying to accomplish when I first got here I just wanted them to dislike me so much they send me home well I found out that the, 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 the harder you are to get through to the longer you're going to stay so I decided to join forces listen and as I started to listen, I started to get enlightened. The truth started coming out and they never buried. I tried to go back to the old ways, not a chance. And every instructor I had was the same. And once I got on board, and once I, I believed what truth was, the real truth, things started to fall in place and it got easier. God, because I, I respect them with all my heart. I trust them, and I know that they cared about me. I wasn't here just, a, just something to do. They cared. They wanted me to get better, and I did. Well, the, the truth. Don't make something up. Go try. If you can't remember, get somebody to help you remember. Get the experts. They've got it in writing. The original doctor was there. The original technicians in the emergency room were there. The ambulance drivers were there. These people all know what I did. Absolutely. Absolutely. One hundred percent. Yes. And but get here with your with your head on right and pointing in the right direction. Because the sooner you're on board and helping them to help you, the faster it'll go.
the uncomfortable truth, especially if you're trying to hide it, because they're here to help you, and boy, they will. And once they know you're on board and you're trying to, they try all the harder. My wife pushed me to stay here. Back when I first got here and told her I, I wanted to go home, and she said, no, give them a chance. And she was right. My wife loves the program. Yeah, the so way, the way it's changed me pretty much almost back to where I was. She's seen a huge difference in me within two weeks.